Yo, what is up, guys? Who's he here back again with another video? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to fix uh, the kernel key system errors that you might be getting. So, the errors we're gonna go through are the loot labs failed, the HWD, HWID not found, and then the last one is uh, unable to reach the site or error connection timed out or um, site unreachable. So, I'm gonna go through all those errors and then I'm gonna just show you how to get your kernel key. Uh, so let's get into it. So before I do that, I just want to answer uh, questions. I already know there's going to be questions about kernel PC, kernel Windows. Is that coming? When is it coming? Uh, yes, it's coming. We already are. We're about to start testing very soon. But um, you guys, uh, we will update you on when that is. There's no set date. And kernel iOS has been released, so you can download that. Um, uh, there's a video on my channel that says... Uh, uh, if you go to YouTube Shorts on my channel, then you'll find it there, but that's where you can do that. So, first thing you're going to want to do is obviously have kernel installed the latest version. Um, I recommend you do the basic key because the fast key you can get stuck on one hour error uh, link for time. So, I recommend the basic key and you're going to want to click get key, right? So, just click get key. And then you can go on, um, on if you're on Android and not on an emulator, then you could just go to uh, Chrome and paste the key uh, but you have to click this get key button or else you're gonna get the HWID error so I'm here on my main PC and then I'm just gonna put in the key uh, so as you can see you need to have this exactly here as you can see it says HWID and then it puts it in there so if it's this not here then you're gonna get that error that says um, HWID not found right so as you can see here it's gonna give me this error so I need to copy in that key what I got from uh, Roblox exactly and then it's going to take me to the checkpoint right now if you're here and it says uh, unable to reach site or site unreachable then what you have to do is download a VPN uh, the one I recommend is either Windscribe or Proton VPN alright so once you have one of those VPNs installed you go to the website and then it should work uh, if you're on mobile then you can also do the same thing you should, you should work fine And then we go to right where this is showing. And then it's going to prompt you to do this. And then you have to wait a minute. And then uh, you just go through the step four times, basically. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to fix the loot labs failed or link for ties failed errors. So this is what happens. So I'm just going to uh, do it. And then you're going to get this right here. So all you need to do if you get this is literally just wait. Just don't do anything, and then it's going to take you back to the checkpoint. That's literally all you need to do. People come in the Discord, and they start complaining like, Oh, it's not working, it's not working. They, try it. they don't even wait the five seconds, right? So wait the five seconds, and then it'll, it'll take you here. That's all you need to do. There's no other steps required, obviously. So now we finish the checkpoint, and we're going to continue. And just do the step again, right? It shouldn't take as long. For some reason, mine takes a really long time to do the loot labs, but most people's only takes like 30 seconds, but mine is taking a minute. Sometimes it even takes me like 70 seconds. So, I mean, it is kind of annoying, but uh, soon uh, uh, the kernel keys might be monthly, so <coughs> uh, you might be able to uh, pay for a key that lasts the whole month. So, we'll keep you notified, guys. Make sure you join our Discord if you need help with anything. Because that's where the only place you can get kernel help is. Alright, so I'm on the last step here. Um, and in uh, 30 seconds, I'll be able to get my key. So then I'm going to show you how to put in the key correctly. And make sure you don't have any errors. And then if you try to put in your key, and it says fail to authenticate user, I'm going to show you um, what you can do for that. But all you need to do if it says fail to authenticate user when you try to put in your key is you need to... Uh, go back and you need to use a VPN right so that happens because your website your um, your system is like blocking kernel from being able to read um, the database or whatever so what you actually need to do is just use a VPN as I said Proton VPN Winscribe uh, or even a browser VPN should work fine but if it's saying you fail to authenticate user then you should use a an application VPN and then after that um you could turn it off after you've uh, got it working. All right, now I finished the step now, so I could just go here, and it's gonna give me my key, and we can close 
is uh, out of here and we can minimize this all right so we're here and just paste the key that's all you gotta do paste and click verify and it's now you can fully use kernel as you can see um, I'll also prove by doing executing script right here and we can fly as you can see everything works fine right so if you have any issues guys join the discord it'll be first link in the description if you have any questions ask in the comments and uh, please like the video so that people that have issues with this can also get help because uh, the way YouTube works is that it based off the number of likes you get so if you get more likes then more people that have issues with this can see it so I don't want people to be having issues and whatnot so uh, please give it a like and uh, yeah ask any questions you have in the comments and uh, peace out